Hello, everyone. Welcome back to JC's Chapel. We have special interview with 10th graders. Yeah. Welcome, welcome. Uh, thanks for joining uh, this great uh, chapel and opportunity. We are now here in Inje, Gangwon-do. Are you happy? Yeah. yeah. Look at this beautiful nature. Uh, I know it's a little bit hot, but like, you know, everyone looks cold, right? <laughs> so long, so long, ha, Joe. Yeah. So there are many people watching uh, this uh, chapel, and every week, some uh, the subscribing, following us to meet you, see your face, and hear your beautiful voices. Do you know that? Uh, today, let's kind of uh, talk about a lot of our life stories, stories about you, stories about your life, school experiences. And last one is probably back to the uh, Bible, how we uh, learn from the Bible and favorite Bible chapters or stories, something like that. We could uh, encourage other audiences, you know, they may uh, re they remember or uh, maybe read the Bible or maybe back to uh, maybe Christian a better in life. So, okay, we're going to start with your great, brief, beautiful introduction from here, Jason Park. Hello everyone, my name is Jason Park. I'm in 10th grade. Uh, yes. Thank you, yeah. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is James Cho, who is also in 10th grade. I'm a typical math nerd who, oh. who also used to, used to really like what Noah teaches, who is <laughs> Carnegie Mellon University. Oh, probably. that's yeah. a goal, okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Christine Park. I'm also currently in 10th grade and my favorite subject, I like all the subjects, but if I am to choose one, it would be English. Hmm, English. Yeah. Any reasons why you like English? Uh, I just like to uh, interpret and analyze things that I read in mm. my own way. Mm. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Next. Hi everyone, I am Jinny Kim and I'm also in 10th grade and my favorite subject is also English as Christine. Good job, thank you. Hi everyone, um, my name is Hwan Hee and I'm also in 10th grade and I also like um, English as Christine and Jinny um, because of like the stories that we can hear, hear about them. Um, I think that's why I like English. Mm. Thank you. Okay, all right, good job. Next. Hello, my name is Daniel Long, and my favorite subject is math because I like to solve problems. All right, problem solver. Okay. Uh, hi, my name is Hyunu Lim, and I'm in 10th grade too. And I've been here at JCS for one year. Mm. And my favorite subject is math because mm. I, I like to solve math equation. Yeah. Mm, okay, thank you. There are so many uh, math genius here. So I hope that uh, you guys hit the uh, 800 SAT scores uh, pretty soon next year, right? I hope so. Okay. All right, today we have a, a couple of questions. Uh, we could uh, exchange our views and opinions together. So please do not be nerve and even scary or kind of feel free home and uh, let's say confidence so the question is this one how were 2023 jcs exchange programs you participate in so far you what would you what would be the best what would be the best memorable moment so far what would be the most exciting program you expected so three questions basically so how do you feel so far next one what was the best memory so far and what would be your expectation to, for the rest of the day okay so okay let me start from here jason james for for this exchange program uh i i really appreciate this time to have uh times with my friends and, and 
students in this school and teachers. And we can learn about nature more mm. and look at nature. Uh, the most memorable thing in, in this exchange program is, I think, hiking mountains. Because I, I like to watch trees mm. a lot. My expectation in this exchange program is uh, not, getting, not getting hurt because a lot of students get hurt mm. while like uh, tripping or getting sick. Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you. Uh, for overall, for overall uh, exchange program, I felt, I felt most of the activities were pretty, pretty so social and mm. <laughs> and was pretty active, uh, making maybe fi finding and making friends in there. Mm. Uh, the most memorable one though is, would probably. We'll also be hiking, as Jason said, because it's something that it's something it's some feeling of kind of grinding and then getting getting the reward that everyone who participated there there felt like you hiked re really high up and hard, and then as and then you see the beautiful birch tree tree like the views in there in return. Mm. Uh, I I felt pretty I'm pretty proud for that. Uh, for the rest of the days, uh, uh, not 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 only for the safety that Jason mentioned, but I also hope the, hope the the few, the students would also par perhaps participate more in the activities. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sure. Thank you very much. All right. Next question. We're gonna move on. So there are a lot of probably reasons and the uh, situations you went through uh, select a school uh, per, uh, especially the our school uh, Juniper Christian school so maybe um, kind of silly question but you've been here a while so um, what about this question if I uh, would ask this question how would you select the school as your uh, let's say school for your middle and high or elementary what was the uh, you know uh, situation reasons that you select the school and uh, you know, you've been here or studying here. What was the most memorable uh, programs, lessons so far you have learned while studying at JCS? From Christine. Yeah. Um, so I have been in this school for quite um, years. Mm. So I have been here for eight years. And uh, I was like preparing for my first grade. And my mom and my parents were also preparing for it. And my mom and dad really wanted a Christian school. And uh, JCS was also established when the timing, when I had to go on the first grade. Mm. First grade. So I think that's how I think God prepared for us because mm. my mom and dad prayed a lot. And also my family mm. also pray prayed a lot. So I think that is how I came mm. to this school and uh, I think most memorable event uh, so far in uh, my Stacia school life is MUN oh. yeah because I get to interact with other school people and it felt like JCS not JCS is not just a small school but we get to interact with other big schools too mm. so yeah, and also I liked how mm, we get to uh, be friendly with our school students, mm. and I really liked it. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay, good job. How about Jeannie? Um, the reason I went here is because I was here at elementary school, so um, I did the musical before I went here. Oh, musical. Right. The musical. And it was really good memory for me. So I decided with my mom. Mm. And I think it was a good decision. Um, and my most memorable event in JCS is... Um, I think last year, Inja was more memorable for oh. me. 
because I think the most memorable part in last year Inje is we saw the stars at oh. night and I think it was really interesting to see the stars with our classmates and our school members mm -hmm. so yeah it's my memorable event maybe this year you're gonna also uh, watch the observe the uh, a lot of stars then yeah mm -hmm. yesterday we saw the stars we have a lot of stars here yeah, no <laughs> Okay, all right. Let's move on. Next question. So, while studying here at uh, Jeju Christian School, I'm pretty sure that there must be some challenges or difficulties. Not easy at all, but sometimes easy. But you know, a lot of struggling moments uh, you may go through. So, in this situation, uh, how did you overcome? And what was the uh, most difficult, challenging situation while studying uh, Jeju Christian School? All right, Hani Jang. Well, um, this question is actually uh, really fits with me because, um, well, I had a lot of hardness about studying at JCS because um, not only for the quality of study, and, but because, um, well, one part of it is maybe i've never tried to study as like with my full heart um but after meeting many teachers and they supported me very much and especially mr joseph like while i wasn't doing my homeworks very well, <laughs> well <laughs> i i um agree with that but even though um, he could just leave me away, but he really supported me. Mm. Yes. Okay, I see. Which is a mentorship uh, was uh, quite um, an important key uh, for su her success or achievement. All right, next person, Daniel Nam. Um, I think my challenges in my JCS school was um, mostly biology, studying biology. <laughs> biology. Um, because um, I don't have really um, like have a good instant memory and like I didn't really like biology too so like I didn't really study too and it is hard for me to understand but I um, by Dr. Sun's support and main teacher's support I wanted to overcome it but mm. the time was so fast so I couldn't do a big thing but yeah Got it. Okay, thank you. So, um, what about this question though? What was, you know, while you guys staying here, what was it so far most memorable, meaningful uh, academic or education programs we, which um, the school provided, JCS provided? Hyunwoo. Okay, my most memorable events in JCS was ski and snowboard trip. Oh. Uh, before, before I went to ski and snowboard trip, I really didn't like to snowboard. Mm. But after I went to ski and snowboard trip, I really started to like riding snowboard. And I want to go to ski and snowboard trip now. Mm. Really. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's uh, move on to the more practical question, uh, like for you uh, as a students and uh, now 10th graders and, you know, more academically, more serious stage you are going to, you know, move on. So, which is a college prep. If you have a chance to study, uh, let's say at uh, any uh, university, uh, what would be your favorite subject or major or field that you want to study and you would like to spend your entire life. You may have no idea, but you know, at least about 10%, I'm quite interested, or I really like it. Or maybe you don't feel that, oh, spend a lot of time, which is to really uh, pay attention, uh, focus on a certain subject. What would be? What would be your career, or would be your subject you like to maybe study? Okay, so from maybe like this way, here, Hyunwoo. Uh, my, uh, my major 
I want my major to be uh, architecture mm. because I want to be architect because I when I was young and now I really liked to imagine my own houses and place that I'll play so I want to do that so I want to be architect mm. in the future yeah. good thank you what about maybe not many you know everyone you don't need to speak but anyone you want to share okay Christine first thing I came that came into my mind was biblical studies mm. because biblical studies yeah Oh. Uh, Do you know what biblical study is? s h i n a k y o And yeah, and I, and and academically, I am very interested in biology, so I also like that. But and I also want to study like professional musical things mm. because I've done a lot of things, and I really like acting and singing. So I think I really like those. Okay. Mm, Anyone else? Maybe Jeannie? Okay. Um, I haven't decided yet for my major for university, but maybe public relation is mm. what comes to my mind. Oh. And like, um, I don't have like specific reason, but I saw this major and I thought, oh, this really fits for me. So mm. yeah, if I go to, if I need to choose a major, then... I think public relations is most good. Good. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. How about this table? Uh, maybe Honey, do you? Well, um, well, my I have two favorite um things majors that I want to go. Mm. Is one is animation or, and other one is about singing. But um, more than singing, I think I prefer mm. um. Animation. No oh, animation. So, um, well, I like to draw something, mm. yeah. and for when in my phone, like mm. I watch YouTube about many animations, and when I see like very high quality of videos, like I think I get really amazed about it. Mm. Um, so it makes my Oh, my heart really beat faster, and I really want to make them like if mm. I have a chance. Mm. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Maybe we have some <laughs> some students who haven't spoke. Can can we give them some chance? Maybe a dinner now. Um, my major is. I want to go my major as computer science. Uh, the reason is that I like computer science um, when I was young. I started to like it, and I just yeah, I just like it. Mm. Do you want to be hacker? Um, maybe. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you. How about James? Uh, I'm thinking about two things in my mind. t o the first thing is engineering, like. Uh, I I like having perspective of trying to try and try to uh, fi- fix the problem by by physically ma- making out, out something and des- designing it and kind of like a mathematical perspective. Uh, so I I wanted to study and l- learn more in depth in depth for engineering. Another thing is I'm undetermined for like specific major, but I have really good interest in music. Mm, or music, uh, huh? Because because it's one of it's a one form of art art that I re- really into, and I I've also heard like in, in some in some TV show when I was in elementary that math and music are mm. are actually quite alike, like how how. The, How they're kind of like sets of rules, but they can be really flexible mm. and creatively made, mm. and make a form of art. Okay, Jason. I want my major to be 
economics. Oh. Because my dream job is in accountant. Oh, ah,、uh, because like I like to manage fi- finances with my parents. Hmm. Okay. So you wanna be a number person? Okay, got it. Okay. How about this question? We almost finish. Um, what if you have a chance less about ten minutes? God, He will give you ten minutes to meet and talk our hero Jesus Christ. In this moment, what would be your questions, and what would you know from Jesus? Do you understand? Okay,、uh, James. If I had a、uh, chance to talk talk to Jesus with、like, for ten minutes,、uh, the question I would really like to ask is、uh, in in the subject of love. I heard about unconditional love with God.、Mm. I I might want to ask how can how can I achieve that unconditional love to others?、Mm. Uh, because because like in. Because even even for my dad,、uh, he emphasizes thanking others,、mm. others to kind of show show them lo- love and the mind that they they care for each each other.、Uh, I'm thinking his answer might be that. I'm thinking his answer might be that to、uh, to stay stay humble to others and. <coughs> And also, and also, maybe support them in the way way we we can in in the moment.、Mm. Perhaps、uh, I'm also unsure about the more more in depth answer, but、mm. I'm guessing what that、uh, might be. Okay, maybe I would like to ask this question to only、uh, this group, and then we're gonna move on this group with the different questions. Okay, all right. How about Jason? Like, if he has one, what is the Think he would he want he would want to change in this earth, like uh, because like humans are quite destroying the earth, like pollutioning, trashing、uh, trashes on in the on the ground. Uh, I think I think I want to ask ask those questions to、mm. Christian. <coughs> I think I will ask God about His will. I don't know. I'm not sure if He's going to ask、mm, a、mm. answer, but I want to know how He will use me in the future. And because I sometimes feel useless and insecure,、mm. and so I think I will ask for His will and to comfort me.、Mm. Yeah. Comfort. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I don't think I'll like ask questions a lot, but just to talk with him. Okay.、Yeah. How about Jenny?、Uh, my question, I think it'll be: Am I a good Christian、uh, in the past, or like right now? Because、um, I just want to be a great Christian、um, in in the present, or because I can't change the past. I just want to ask him.、Um, Am I a good Christian? And I, it can be my motivation、mm. of being a better Christian. If you said no, the world would say it'd be better motivation for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you for honest. All right. Okay, next one is、um, the Bible. Your favorite parts or stories and verses you may have. So let's briefly share what would be your. Uh, favorite Bible story or Bible verse from Honey. So my favorite Bible verse is Matthew chapter six and verse forty-three through forty-four. Um, so it's about love your love your enemies. So I'll、mm. briefly read the Bible verse. You have heard that it was said. Love your neighbors and hate your enemy. But I tell you, love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you. Well, actually, there's more about like forty-five. But、um, why I chose these two、um, 
differences because uh, living our lives it's hard to love everybody like even though you're um you're like, uh, um you like pe people's um there's many harsh um problems when you while you leave live so uh because in my personal um life i didn't meet so much good friends in my life so um that's why i like um this chapter mm. um to try to like him not even though it's not loving them so i think this chapter makes me to motivate to like anyone mm. who is my okay thank you how about daniel now um so my favorite bible story is about um is called good samaritan so good samaritan yeah so i think i like like this bible story and learned that we need to help everyone um mm. even though um the person the person who needs help is enemy of yours mm. or different from you we need to first help them no matter what mm. and show love of christ good thank you how about hello oh my favorite bible verse is genesis chapter 1 verse 1 oh. because it says oh, god created heavens and the earth and it is the start of the earth mm. and I'm very thankful for that I can live like this yeah God's creation yeah mm, okay all right any anyway thank you so much for your time and uh, it's really hot but what a fun time we do have so uh, did you have a good time yeah. okay all right so well, once again uh, this video and the chapel video will be remaining in our school history forever so you you making great history well done good job and uh, let's give a big hands to mr jim all right thank you okay uh, let's pray heads jesus we thank you so much for your blessing uh, thank you for this weather thank you for this moment with gathering together and share our stories Continue to encourage us to be um, following your name and follow your words and demonstrate what you taught us in our lives. So please, like what we have said that, um, you know, this is a Bible verse we really like. Continue, we're going to read more Bible verses. I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, bye-bye.